I've heard a common grave was found. Yes, there are some men buried there. He will tell you. I don't like speaking in front of the camera. It's not news, it's a YouTube channel. Come on, tell them. Well, some guys were security officers. They had some weapons and cameras. Russian soldiers learned about it and threatened them. They shot at their houses so that they'd stay quiet. Then they came to their house at night and shot them dead. They questioned them first, tied their hands. There was a 15-year-old girl. Afterwards, they blew up the place. They wouldn't let us bury them. The girl was from another village, so they let her relatives bury her. The other guys lay there for 40 days until the bodies started stinking. Then there was a rotation of Russian soldiers, and the new ones let us bury the bodies in the yard. Is it Pravdino village? Yes. What's your name, Sasha? Tell us, Sasha, what happened? On April 13th, they took all security officers, tied their hands, shot them all and placed the dynamite and blew up the house. They are buried over there. I've heard they couldn't bury them for a while. Yes, the bodies lay here for almost seven months. Had they decomposed already? Yes. They are buried here. They wouldn't let you bury them? How many people are there? Six or seven. They were shot in this house, and then they blew up the house. Why were they shot? They didn't like the guys, just like that. I've heard they had some drones or something. I don't know. Did you know those people? Yes, I did. They worked in security. They guarded tractors. If you go there, you can see the hole where they place dynamite. Did Russians live here? No, at the time they lived in the fields. Who placed the dynamite? Russians did. They didn't like the guys, because they guarded a facility. Here it is. This big hole. They placed the dynamite there. Most likely. There are probably some heads lying around, because some bodies didn't have heads or arms. They haven't dug out yet. There was no chance to do so. Did they cut their heads off? No, I think they were torn off. They were tied. I didn't see that, but people say they had shot heads and tied hands. Sasha, tell me about the second grave, please. Those are soldiers. I wasn't here when they were buried. It was in the summer. When the Ukrainian armed forces were attacking, soldiers died. And people from the village buried them where they could. In yards, in houses. So they weren't captive people, were they? No, they died when attacking. When they were attacking, they went through the village and further to reconnoiter. Orcs saw them and started shooting at houses in the street with a tank. They ruined the block. If you go there, it's about 200 meters. I can show you where soldiers were buried.